Hello everybody, what's up? Tyler here with Player Select Gaming and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today we're going to be q and a we're going to be caving and talking. And who knows what else we'll do. Uh, but first we need to clean up our inventory a little bit. What am I going to do with this netherrack? I don't want this hanging around everywhere. And so hopefully everybody's having a great day today. It is currently a Tuesday evening. Tuesday night, whatever you want to call it for me. And we're not the whole way. We're not halfway through the week yet. We're getting there. Um, slowly but surely, we will we will make it. And uh, I was doing a little bit of enchanting before I started the video. And I, I just like to make sure I'm recording on everything. Oh, really? My, uh... Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. My uh, webcam thing was blocking up my questions for the Q&A. I looked over, I was like, I can't see any questions. I was like, great, thanks. But uh, before I started recording, I was actually doing a little bit of enchanting. That is what I was doing. Um, and I got up to efficiency three on my shovel. Um, and I got a fortune one book. I'd like to make this fortune three. That would be the plan. Um, I think I'm gonna take I don't know. See, I need diamonds, but I don't know if I want to wait until I get a fortune three pick. So I might take my silk touch pick along with me when we go to the cave. Um, and then, yeah. And wait to, and get the diamond ores and then just wait until I have a fortune three to mine them. Um, unless I need it like right now, which I don't really need any right now. Look at that. I don't think I made any progress on it. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's the plan. Uh, let's put these rails away and we can go start caving. I'm not really sure where we're going to go. Um, I'm thinking maybe go from... I don't know what rails up here. From the skeleton spawner. I think that would be a, like kind of like a good starting point. Uh, we don't need ladders. We don't we even need arrows. Get those out of here. Uh, we have food, a little bit of dirt, sticks, coal. We need some coal because we might need to make torches. Hey, look, XP, thank you. Yeah, I'm running low on some stone. We need to get some of that. Um, so let's just go down. And uh, I've been thinking, you know, how we want to build this place up around here. I'm still thinking about this village area right in there. Um, I'm thinking, you know, do I want to make it kind of like in the forest, like create a forest and then um, put them like in tree houses? But I'm, I'm kind of tired of the tree house thing. I, I've tried to do that a couple times. Where am I going? I can't get out of here. Like, I don't even know how to get out of this place. Um, so I'm thinking of maybe just making houses for them. Uh, but it, I don't know. We'll see. And I have a sweatshirt on because it's kind of cold. But it's kind of like pulling on my neck or something. What in the world's my deal? Oh, yeah. I haven't even touched this thing yet um, in terms of building something around it. Uh, I kind of want to see, you know, what theme I want to go with around here. Um, up there, we have a lot of stone. Um, but we're kind of on the side of a mountain. But down here, you know, do I want to have a lot of wood or still stone? Um, like, still stone-like. Not like a type of stone still, no. But just like still using stone. Um, or do I want to use wood? I might make a little mixture of both, maybe. These trees have been here forever. I need to actually do something about them. Chop them down or something. Okay, here we go. Okay, no. Very anticlimactic. Okay, here we go. Come on. Here we go. Come on. Finally, I got my big jar of water. We're ready. Oh, nothing better than a good jar of water. And it makes your beard all wet if you have a beard. I'm thinking about doing a video over on my Tea Game and Tech channel called um, Why Beards Are Awesome or something like Top 10 Reasons or Top 5 Reasons to Have a Beard. Um, something like that. Uh... You know what? Let's just dig down and see if we hit anything. I have no idea if we will. Oh, well, I guess we will. Okay, that was quick. Oh, look what we just ran into. The old, uh... Hello! Blew me up, buttercup. Okay. Sorry about that, bat. I need this coal. Because I need to make some torches. I know I brought some coal along, but this helps. As long as I don't get blown up. Okay. A zombie. You shall be smitten. Oh, man. Okay, there we go. Now, what was I saying? I can't not remember what I was saying. 
but it's okay because we are down in a cave now. Now, which way do we want to go? Um, ooh, that looks pretty good. Oh, it looks like there might be a spawner down this way. Hello. I don't think there is. I guess I really haven't explored, so I don't really know. Um, well, let's tarry on through here. There has to be one somewhere. They're coming from everywhere around here. Okay. Nothing here. Um, so let's start with the Q&A. There's not a lot of questions. That's okay. Um, doesn't need to be a lot of questions. I will answer ev even one question. There's more than one. Um, oh man, it goes up there too. So the first question is from Rule... Rolig verse. I'm sorry if I butcher people's names. Um, I, I didn't go to school to read names correctly. So there is a great chance that I find a stronghold. I have no idea this was around here. This is really close to our home. Wow. This might be one of the best spawns ever. Okay, I thought my last spawn was pretty good, like in the last world, because the uh, the end wasn't too far away. But this, I think, is by far the best. I mean, I have a skeleton spawner. Um, am I at the top yet? I have a skeleton spawner. Now I have, um, a, what is this place called? A stronghold? If I would have died, it would been a bad thing. Um, stronghold, potentially maybe some more spawners, no idea. What if this comes up like right underneath my house? We'll find out. Okay, are we right beside the tree farm? We're not. Right in the corner of the woods here. Well, I'm not going to complain, my friends. Well, we that's probably the first time I've ever found a stronghold. Uh, without using an eye of ender so that's always good but anyways back to what we were talking about first q a question um he actually asked us twice but i'll just you know for your q a how did you come up with your username you said maybe try terra firma terra firma craft um is that what b double o and generic b are doing um i don't think that's public at least not right now and i don't know if they're going to make it public um but that's that borders again on the little bit of too hardcore survival uh, Minecraft because um, I think right now I just want to do some stuff that's just a little bit more relaxing, just fun. Um, that's not limiting like that because in those uh, mod packs, like you're starting from scratch, and I don't want to sit here and start from scratch all the time. Um, I did try um, running the Dire Wolf pack, um, Feed the Beast, and it lagged really bad. Like when I was recording, I was getting 20 frames per second and there's no way. Um, hmm. Do I want to explore this now? Sure. Why not? Let's go for it. We'll explore it right now. Um, it really wasn't the plan, but I guess it's in the plan now, isn't it? What level do we get to here? 33. We're not even close to diamonds. I went for diamonds and now I'm in this stronghold. Um, but yeah, I tried. What the heck is up with this? Let me just walk through this door that doesn't even lead anywhere because, yeah. Oh, they're. Oh, I forgot about these. There could be diamonds right up in here in these chests. Come on, diamonds. Really? Two things I don't need at all. Well, whatever. I'll take them. Okay. So, yeah, I'm still kind of looking for a modded Minecraft uh, series thing. Um, I've looked at a little bit of the other mod packs, but... Oh, yeah, I forgot. Every time I walk through a door, I'm going to chop it down. Don't let me forget that. Oh. We found the library. Okay. And we found a hut. Very good. Are there chests in here? I think there are. This is a really weird stronghold because, like, everything's missing. Um, so, yeah. Where did I come up with my username? Uh, okay. So, I'll talk about Player Select Gaming and King of Links. Um, Player Select Gaming, uh, back in the day, 
which really wasn't back in the day really all that much. I see a chest. Uh, I had a blog, and I still do. Um, it was my gaming blog, uh, where I would post about video games, uh, video game news, uh, my thoughts on things, and uh, stuff and the like. Yeah. And I was already... Wow, I was pretty close. Or something. And it was called Player Select Gaming. And I got it from the Player Select screen. Um, like, whenever... For like a game like Smash Brothers. Whenever you select your character, that's called the Player Select screen. And a lot of older games, it actually... You know, it says Player Select at the top. Um, I'm pretty sure it select, says that on Mario Kart 64. You know, Mario says, Select your player. Or, Select your player. I'm not really doing a good job because my voice hurts. Um, it doesn't hurt, but it's not very strong right now. But, uh, yeah. And it says player select above it. What a stupid book. Now, can I get Fortune 2 off of there? I don't know. I don't know if I can or not. I guess we'll find out. I'll take all these books, though. If you don't mind, I'll just take them all. Um, so that's kind of where I got the name for the YouTube channel, Player Select Gaming. Um, you know, you select your player, and hey, we're gaming. And so that's where that came from. So pretty self-explanatory, not really too complicated um, for that. Is there any other chests in the library? Or is there just one? Oh, I see another one. This one might be a little more tricky. Okay, let's light this up here. I don't want any bad things happening to me while I'm in the library. You know, keep peace and quiet around here, please. Where's that? Here it is. Just a bunch of stupid books. Exactly what I wanted. Stupid thing. Um, do we see any more chests? I don't. I do not. I know I should probably save those and not destroy all of them. But there's a lot. Oh. Okay. Um, do I dare venture down here? Nah. Let's not. Let's keep exploring. Um, so yeah, that's where Player Select Gaming came from. Anything in here? No. We'll block it up. And the... Yeah. What Do I want to say anything else about Player Select Gaming? Um... I don't think so. Another chest. Are you serious? What a waste. Y'all build my hopes up just to give me iron chest pieces. I don't want that junk. Okay. Sometimes there are spawners branched off these things. And I just want to make sure there's not. Plus, lighting up this cave will help with the spawning rates if I make a, like a mob spawner or, you know, the skeleton farm. Um, that'll help out as well. Okay, let's go up this way. Just make a double check here. I think that's all I want to say about player select gaming. Um, you know, your player select screen. And King of Links, uh, really, it was just completely random. Um, I needed a name for the Wii U. I didn't want to use Blue Link 16, which was my old Insider screen name. If you were on the Insider forums back in the day, um, I was the guy called Blue Link 16. I actually had a comic series, and it was very successful. Um, and it's kind of weird looking back. and Like, I did the Insiders. Did I just go down here? Yeah, I just made a huge loop. Come on now. Get on the level. Okay, we went through there. We didn't go through here. Um, I had a comic series. Um, one was called... Well, actually, I had many, so I can't just say one. Um, I had Mario and the Psycho Shrooms, but the joke was I spelled the title wrong, so it was Mario and the Fisco Shrooms. Um, Luigi's Conquest. Yoshi and the Missing Egg. Uh, Ice Meets World. And Ice was actually a character I created myself, designed the sprite myself. He's just a snowman. It wasn't anything awesome. But uh, he had a very sarcastic personality, and that hit off with a lot of people. A lot of people were like, yeah, this dude's awesome. And so that was a successful um, comic series, Ice Meets World. 
and I did, and Ice actually came from a Christmas special I did. It was Yoshi's Christmas Countdown or something like that, and uh, that's where Ice came from, and everybody liked his character so much that I just kept him. Um, anything good down here? A little bit of redstone. Is that all you got for me? A little lava pool. Is that all you got? Uh, and to say whatever. Let's just double check. Let's go this way. What if it was like, oh, hello, end portal. But it's not. Oh, hello. Hello, chest. Um, so, yeah, I was bootleg 16 on the inside of forums. Diamonds! This is literally the worst round of chests that I've ever seen in a stronghold. Like, this is bad. Real bad. Like, real steel kind of real bad. What is this? Like, come on, people. Come on, Majang. What is up with this? Like, this is just bad. We'll go through here. We'll see what's all up in here. How about a thing of water? Thank you. Don't push me in the lava now. What level are we on? 11. How deep is the end portal? Is it like at a certain level? Or is it just kind of random? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but yeah, King of Lynx itself was kind of random. Because I was like, hey, you know. I want to do Legend of Time or something. Or Hero of Time. And I almost went the corny route of spelling time, T-Y-M-E. But I was like, okay, like, I'm not going to deal with this because that's just stupid. Um, so instead I went with something else, which was King of Links. And it's not bad. Um, you know, there's been better in-game names, but honestly, I don't really care. Um, it's just the name that I register with. I don't go by King of Links uh, on any forums or anything. Uh, just on the Wii U. And, yeah. So that's where that name came from. Okay. There's got to be diamonds down here. Now I'm getting a little bit further away from my uh, fortress than I'd like to be. But we'll, we'll find our way back. Oh, whoa. Did I see diamonds? No. Stinking gold. Who wants gold? Okay. Uh... No! Okay. Are we good? Yes. Um, so that's it for that question. Okay, it took me about 20 minutes to answer one, that one question. Um, I would like to start an animation business for your QA, blah, 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 blah. Okay, no, that was something else. Um, if you would like to start your own business, this really wasn't a question, but uh, I talked about starting your own business and owning your own business in a previous episode and some of the struggles and stuff with it. Um, but it's definitely worth it if you can um, get it off the ground early and when you have time to spare. Don't wait until you are out of college and have debt to say, well, I think I want to make a business. I mean, that's not a bad time to do it, but... Oh, lag. But it's nice, you know, having a plan, you know, a little bit before all this debt just happens. Um, but right now, I mean... I'm working with Summer right now, and she is wanting to sell um, some... What is up with the lag spikes? She's wanting to sell some homemade uh, cosmetic products, and I'm working with her right now to get everything set up. Um, it's not like an actual registered business or anything. Like, my business is an LLC. It's registered business. Um, but right now, this is kind of like a thing um, that we're just kind of test running. Um, a lot of people have showed interest in it, and we do plan on selling online, and... Um, if you are interested, you know, you can buy, uh, the products that we have right now are beard oil and sugar, hand scrubs that are like from sugar and it's all natural stuff. Um, you know, it's no chemicals or anything. The sugar scrubs is pretty much sugar and coconut oil and essential oils to make it smell good. Um, and other flavors like peppermint and, uh, there's cocoa ones, pumpkin, all kinds of stuff. And we need to make some torches, my friends. Get rid of this. This is what happens when you find those stupid, uh, whatever they're called. Get rid of that. Um, oh my gosh, I can't think of the name. 
the thing that I found, you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna fall in lava if I'm not careful. Okay, now where's the, my way out of here? That's my next question. Was it this way? <laughs> no. Now I gotta try to find my way out. Um, is it this way? Or is this the way I just came? I'm lost. Okay, I think I need to make a right hand turn over here. Make a hard right, I think. No, this is the way I need to go because I cross. Oh, I hope I don't get lost. But yeah, if you want to start a business, uh, the best advice I could say is start early and don't give up. Be, um, be consistent with it and do not get lazy like I might have gotten with mine. Um, if I really would have been dedicated and went out and uh, tried to advertise more, I wouldn't be having to work a... What is this? I wouldn't have to work a 40-hour-a-week job. Just saying. Um, you know, I don't hate my job, but I would much rather wake up every day, make YouTube videos, work on my business stuff, and worry about that. But uh, this... You know, and things can change overnight. You know, if I this channel might grow to a million subscribers overnight, and if it did, thank goodness, I would just dance and scream and scream like a little girl. But uh, oh, we can't say that. Um, you know, that might be offensive. And you know, I watched that ad. You know, throw like a girl, and it's like, okay, I understand. You don't want to like demean girls or anything, but I don't know. I think sometimes society just needs to toughen up a little bit. You know, I, I understand sometimes when you say things are like, do this like a girl or you, you throw like a girl. Okay, you know, that's not very nice because some girls could probably whoop most boys um, in some things. But, you know, scream like a girl. Okay, girls scream one way, you know. But maybe that's not what they're talking about. But anyways, I won't get on that subject. You know, that could be a touchy subject for people. And I don't really want to get into that. Um, so let's just get back to the Q&A, why don't we? I'm lost. Uh, I'm not even in the ground, the ground hole. The ground stronghold. What are we talking about? Um, I'm getting gold, though. Good grief. Which is a good thing. What's the next question? Why are you so cool? Exactly why. I have a beard. No, just kidding. Um, I don't like to call myself cool. You know, I, I would consider myself acceptable to people <laughs> i don't like strive to be accepted by everybody oh i feel like there's some diamonds up in here but i feel like i'm a person that's easy to like i don't i don't like getting on people's nerves and i like to keep peace with people i don't like confrontation and so i guess that makes me cool um and you think i'm cool that's cool and yeah thanks for your compliment okay i need to get rid of this stupid thing give me some real blocks would you Cobblestone. Okay. Good. Oh, good grief. That scared me. I jumped. Could you see me flinch? Okay, I might not jump, but I know I flinched. Hey, look, we're, ba we're back here. How great. Unless this is a different one. Which I don't think it is. I jumped again. I knew he was coming too. Man. What is this? Did I put that there? I think. Okay, I know there's gold up there, but whatever. I'm looking for diamonds, people. And I haven't found any. And this ain't doing good. It's bad. Doing real bad. Oh, yeah. What are you blowing up so far away for, son? Chill out. Okay, there's gotta be diamonds here. Like, look how expansive this place is. Like, come on. Okay, bad. Okay. I'm on diamond level. So much open area and no diamonds. Pfft. What an annoyance. Guess I'll take the gold, though. Um, What's some more questions here? Why don't you play with some texture pack? I like the look of vanilla Minecraft and I, I'm too lazy to look up texture packs. Um, the one texture pack that I've seen that I do like was the faithful texture pack that Doc M77 used for a while, uh, mostly because it just looked like vanilla. Um, 
I like the way vanilla looks. Uh, I don't really have any complaints against it, so I just decide not to use a texture pack. We will find diamonds. Okay, I've had episodes where I find so many. I found 25 diamonds in one episode once. Now, granted, that was with a fortune pick, but still, we had 25 diamonds get dep deposited into our inventory within the span of one episode, and I can't even find a single diamond ore right now. It's getting bad, folks. It's getting real bad. No idea how far away I am from home. But I'm just... I'm, I'm a man on the run. On the run for diamonds. I ain't finding none. Like, seriously. Oh, finally. We see diamonds. Finally. Let's just uh, do a little peeky peek around here. Okay. Lighting up all these caves, though, that's one good thing. A lot of cave lighting. A lot of cave lighting. I'm hoping for at least three. I see three. I see four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Should we just go for it? Yeah, let's use our silk touch. Okay, let's... Uh... We don't need bread. We don't need this. We don't need doors. We don't need arrows either. Silk touch. One, two, three, four. Well, not the greatest, but not the worst. It's better than one. So I figured if I get a fortune three, I'll get maybe ten out of there if I'm lucky. Whoa. I was gonna say, is that the is that like the, the surface? Um probably get 10 out of there. Hmm. And this thing is, I, there could be 50 diamond ores right around here, like under the next block, but I wouldn't know because I'm not digging every single block. I guess that's the one mystery we'll never find out. Now, are these blocks all pre-generated or are they only generated whenever you go to the next block? Like, is the block behind here generated? Yeah, I think they are. Um, okay, well, I can like, we're done with the episode. I got diamonds. Just kidding. Um, <clears throat> we will continue a little bit. Um, answer the texture pack question. Uh, and that's pretty much all the, <laughs> all the questions there really were, honestly. There really weren't a lot of questions. Um, you know, that's just the way things go, I guess. And that's okay. But the fact that I can't find any more diamonds is not okay. How about in here? Oh, hello, 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 hello. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> These guys, I tell you, what? It needs to stop, you guys. It needs to stop. I have a feeling there's diamonds in the roof. Wrong button. 11. Just because they don't get pushed into lava now. Um, so that's all the Q&A questions. I already said that. I was actually going to record a new series earlier this morning, and it was going to be a GameCube game, and I got the GameCube. I'm going to die if I don't be careful. I got the GameCube out. My hair's all messed up. And I realized I have no idea where the charger not the charger but like the the power cord is yeah no idea so uh i need to say i didn't record any gamecube footage so now i gotta figure out where in the world that thing's at um the gamecube was in my sister's bedroom and so i'm thinking that it's still in there um in my parents house i don't know for sure yet i cannot confirm myth not confirmed but I have an inkling that is where it is located. You again. You and your friends need to go. I was already down here anyways. Okay, I'm done in this pit. There's nothing good happening here. I need to get out of this pit. How do I get out of here? I'm trapped forever. I think this might be the way. Uh, but I really wanted to record that series, but I guess, uh, 
GameCube had other thoughts. So at least I recorded this, though, and this will be uploaded Thursday, maybe. I don't know. Whenever I get around to it. Um, and hopefully, it'll be seen by millions of people. And even if it's not seen by millions of people, it is okay. I'm a little bit more agitated that there's such an open expanse here. Don't even care about you, spider. And I can't find diamonds. But at least we found a few. So, I think... I'm going to round, round, round up the episode. I'm going to round it up. And at least we found the stronghold as well. That's actually a really good find because that means the end portal is very close by. And every stronghold has an end portal, correct? Yes. Please say yes. And I'm pretty sure there's multiple strongholds within worlds. I'll take that. Whatever. Are we good? Yes. Multiple strongholds in each world. I only have two torches left. This ain't good. And so yeah, I, I don't really need another stronghold, but I'm just I'm just making a conversation. So I think I'm gonna end the episode because really I'm just staring at this screen right now, trying to think of words to say. No, that's one word to say. Um, and I'm not finding any more diamonds. I, I will probably give up my diamond hunt. Um, maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. I might walk around here a little bit more. But I've been to pretty much everywhere down here. And I've not found diamonds a ton. But I did find four. So, I'm trying to think of anything else I want to say. Um, I, and I really can't. I'm just drawing blanks right now because I'm trying to survive. <laughs> um, and I'm saying I'm a lot and it's really annoying. Um, yeah, um, um, you know, how annoying is it when people say, um, all the time? It is pretty annoying, isn't it? So I'll try not to be annoying. So I'll say so instead. And, or the words like, and, now I'm really starting to ramble. And so I think I'm going to end the episode. <clears throat> Let me know if you guys have any more questions you'd like to have answered. I'll happily answer them on another video. It doesn't have to be Q&A. Or on Twitter. You can all, all follow me on Twitter if you would like. That would be greatly appreciated. You can follow my main Twitter account. It's TylerMillerYT. Um, I do all my tweeting from there. The Player Select Gaming Twitter that tweets out these videos is solely for just tweeting out these videos. I don't post anything on there like ever. And if I do, it's an announcement to follow me on my other account. So if you want to make sure you see all of my updates, follow me on Twitter, TylerMillerYT. Okay. That is done. That is said. Nowhere else to go. I need to go to the surface. And so thank you guys so much for watching. It is very appreciated that you would choose to watch this video. And leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe. Next time we will be working on building some houses for the villagers. We'll be working more with the villagers. Building the little containment area. Uh, maybe. Oh yeah. Hello. Yeah I need to get out of here. There's creepers everywhere. Surviving. That would be a great thing to do in the next episode. And work on some building in general since this was a more of a talky episode and KV and all that other stuff. And so again, thank you so much for watching. I'm on the run. Thank you guys. And we'll see you guys in the next video.